Now to a developing story in Westminster. 7 News getting new video of a fire that gutted a Westminster home last night. This was on Carr Circle near Wadsworth. Family members, including four-year-old twins, were in the basement when it started. They all got out safely. 7 News reporter Lindsay Watts is live. And Lindsay, good news here. Even the family pets were okay. Teresa, I talked on the phone to the couple who lives in this house. And even though they lost just about everything they own, they say they are so grateful that every person and every pet got out safely. Firefighters even went back inside for their reptiles. My son and I um, and the neighbor boy across the street, as soon as I saw it, first thing we did was pray. Fears for the worst for a family of four after their home suddenly ignited. They were in the basement and the mom heard um, a loud noise and so she came up and the whole kitchen was on fire. So they just got out um, and they couldn't get their pets. Cell phone video captured intense flames surrounded by snow and ice. Not easy for firefighters, but they made sure every creature survived. Yeah, he's still a little frazzled. Jake the cat is fine, aside from the soot he's still covered in. This guy, named Stryker, was rescued first by firefighters. Four geckos were also pulled safely from the flames. All the animals now staying at a neighbor's house. Yeah, so they're going to stay here for a while. I guess you guys weren't good friends. <laughs> while people and pets are safe, this is what the house looks like. Firefighters just let us come inside. I talked to the couple who lived here. They are now staying in a hotel. They say they don't know what's next for them. They say they only just moved here from California a few months ago. Whatever they need will be here for them. Although the family is new to the area, generous neighbors are doing much more than just pet sitting for them. The whole neighborhood is, is trying to get, make up collections and the surrounding neighborhoods, everybody wants to help. So that's what we're doing right now is seeing what we can do for them. I have been watching that neighbor you just heard from go door to door right now trying to get people to donate gift cards to the family. Firefighters still are not sure what caused the fire. They think it might have been an electrical issue. Live in Westminster, Lindsay Watts, 7 News.